Well, when you visit downtown Evansville these days, you'll discover so many small businesses that are thriving. Adam Trinkle is here to tell us all about the exciting shopping opportunity known as Small Business Saturday. Good, Good morning. Thanks for having me. I saw me. Adam on his way to the Christmas tree lighting last <laughs> night. It was beautiful when I drove past. Yeah, it's the it's the season of tradition downtown. So yes. we had the tree lighting. The city of Evansville had that last night. We have a lot of our holiday events coming up, the holiday decorations. Mostly are all up. The rest will be finished actually later today. So it's a it's a busy time downtown, but also a very celebratory time to come. It to really Garland. is, and, and everybody's in it. That's what I noticed when we were shooting these segments, Adam. Everybody's excited about having more people in their store to show them the variety of what we have downtown. Yes, absolutely. So Small Business Saturday is coming up. It's a week from tomorrow. It's Saturday, November 25th. So the Saturday after Thanksgiving. Right. Um, this is an event that's taken place since 2010. It was initiated by American Express. Um, and then since 2011, the small business administration has been part of it. We feel like we've been the regional leader and the voice of how important it is to shop small and shop local and dine small and dine local. So we have 50 plus small businesses in downtown Evansville and they are ready to welcome shoppers for the holiday season. So we encourage people to really make that deliberate decision to buy local, shop local and really every day of the week, but especially on Saturday, November 25th. Yeah, you won't want to miss the deals, too, because we've already gotten a preview of quite a few of them. And one of the things you hear all the time, and I hear as a downtown resident, well, I don't know where to park. Well, it's, it's everywhere. <laughs> Parking garages are everywhere. There's all sorts of places to park. There are. There's a lot of places, and maybe you can't find a spot directly in front of the store that you want to go to, but there's one right around the corner. We have parking garages, and then all of the, the, the limits that are posted are not enforced on weekends. On Saturdays. So Sundays, on a yeah. Saturday like this, it's an opportunity to park um, a lot of different spots. You're seeing now a picture. We're giving away free buttons at our stand at the 300 block of Main oh, Street cool. on yeah, that yeah, day yeah. and free shopping bags. So just incentives as you go around and you're strolling around and shopping at these local businesses. Well, you know, you can, if you haven't been down in a while, you might want to come down for a preview to see where you want to be strategic about it and so they can make their way around. And, and you said 50 businesses. That's, yeah, that's including our, our shops, our retail, and our restaurants. And we know that, you know, patterns have changed over time and consumer preferences, right? So right. the patterns of 10 years ago are not the patterns of today. Whereas, you know, online shopping and e-commerce has really changed that. A lot of our stores have online shops. They so do. We encourage yes. you to visit those. Um, but maybe whereas 10 years ago, somebody was physically going to a shop or a store 10 times a year. Now that's, that's decreased because they have the convenience of shopping online. So just driving home that message, make the deliberate choice to shop small this holiday season. 67 cents of every dollar you spend at a local business stays in that community. These are your neighbors, people that are employing other people in our community, and they're also paying it back into the tax base from an economic development perspective. Yeah, it's really a bigger picture of just, you know, shop small, because that just boosts our economy and the excitement and the energy of the neighborhood. Absolutely, and shop small, when you shop small, you're, you know, you're supporting a unique local business, and, and that's what attracts people, that's what attracts visitors, that's what attracts new residents, so we want to make our community a destination. You can do that by shopping small. And you can, and, you know, make it a, make it a day. Have your lunch or brunch or whatever, and then shop and just spend the day downtown. You will really enjoy it. I'm proud of our downtown. I truly am. I'm proud to be a citizen down there and to have seen all the growth and the energy. Thank you for your hard work and your team for bringing that and working so well with our businesses. Well, thank you. We appreciate it. We'll see you there. All right. All right. November